All right, this next one is animated. Um, and it looks like it has something to do with a turtle. So, yeah. Just a second. Uh, so, yeah, let's... Uh, have you heard of this yet? No, no. Okay. Um... Yeah, okay. Well, I don't really know anything about it either. I'm running a little low on time here, so I gotta move forward. So let's check it out. We are watching the trailer for her. Are you a gym rat? Or even just somebody who works to stay healthy through exercise? If so, I have found your new favorite color. Purple. Purple Works Nutrition offers a pre-workout manufactured right here in the good old US of A. Their pre-workout is formulated by a healthcare professional with a simple, easy to understand list of all natural ingredients with no preservatives or artificial flavors. Action Pack members, in the words of the mighty Grom Hellscream, why be strong enough when you can be stronger still? By harnessing the power of purple. Purple Works Pre-Workout is the ultimate pre-workout supplement that targets tried and true ingredients that deliver energy, focus, and strength. You can find this pre-workout at purpleworksnutrition.com. You can find a link in the description down below. Leo, official teaser, Netflix. Coming at us from Netflix, we're gonna like the video. Oh, okay. Uh, actor and comedian Adam Sandler, Hotel Transylvania, The Wedding Singer, delivers signature laughs in this coming-of-age animated musical comedy about the last year of elementary school as seen through the eyes of a class pet. Jaded 74-year-old lizard Leo Sandler has been stuck in the same Florida cast classroom for decades with his terrarium mate, Turtle. Bill Burr. Oh my god. <laughs> when he learns he only has one year left to live, he plans to escape to experience life on the outside, but instead gets caught up in the problems of his anxious students, including an impossibly mean substitute teacher. It ends up being the strangest but most rewarding bucket list ever. All right. I like Adam Sandler. I like Bill Burr. And uh, by the way, Leo is on Netflix this November 21st. So um, yeah, let's check it out. We got a one minute and 20 second trailer. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Here we go. Wow, something's All right. over. Here we go. <laughs> All right, another year, another batch of fifth grade head cases. I tell you what. One Wait a minute. That's Turtle? Uh, that's Leo. That's Leo, yeah. Whatever. No, no. A 70 oh, old, I mean, that's Bill Stanley. Burns, the turtle. Oh, Bill Burr is the turtle. Oh, okay, I was like, family. yeah, yeah, I got you, I got you, okay. Here, another batch of fifth grade head cases. I tell yep. you what, one kid calls me Lizzie this year, I quit. Just don't pee in my lettuce bowl, and we'll be all right. This is I very quiet. Know, I got a feeling this year's gonna be different. Something big is gonna happen. That's what I was saying, how does he know? Okay, he got like the Godzilla. How does he know he's gonna die? It says that he's a 74-year-old lizard. What li I'm, we're going to find out what lizard. Ah, you say that every year. Could you not do that on my pillow? <laughs> okay, I I'm a lizard. lizard. Mm. That's good. Don't dignify it. Breaking out this Back Thanksgiving. To school. Back to school. Back to school. I want to know if there's an actual, if there's a lizard that actually lives that long. 74 years? I have a lizard, uh, a couple of skinks. I have a blue tongue and a fire skink. And they will live to be about 25 years old each. So my kids will be out of the house before those lizards die. Um, but 75 years? Wow. Um, I don't know. What do you think? I know you're not a big Adam Sandler fan. Here we go. I think he's... I think he's clever. I think he, I appreciate his voice. I think he's, he's often pretty lazy. Yeah, I I like. I think he's I've, compelling when he wants to be. Um, I I like you know a lot of his early work and and his later work when he puts in you know a lot murder of murder mystery, on, 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 on uncut great. gems, um, murder mystery too. You know, I liked um, those. Um, Punch drunk love. Offer, I love. I mean, he was he's a funny guy with the and when he puts his heart on display, I think. It, that shows. Do you think he? 
I do think he's a little bit crass and decadent. He doesn't bother to conceal it, which I can respect that he, there's no pretense, but, well, yeah. that's how I feel about him, I guess, yeah. So what, um, yeah, I mean, what do you think about, what do you think about this? Is, does this interest yeah, you at all? I have no clue. Uh, no, not really, but I don't know. I mean, I mean there's not so really much. anything jumping out at us here. In, in in the immediacy, I thought, oh, this reminds me of like Finding Nemo, like them in the in the aquarium trying to get out, you know. Um, yeah, I mean... I mean, he's an iguana, <laughs> what? It was a side quest in that movie. I mean, we, we, yeah. we have these two characters. One of them is very peripherally addressed. It's like they, they speak to each other with this... Um, air of like you know i don't know saturated familiarity they're very hyper you know inert to each other's presence but other than that we don't see them going on adventures we see him hanging over a fence with a kid we don't we see him buckled up in the seat <laughs> Look at, belt. i just want to um, point this out to you we don't know whether or not this is all retrospective or whether or not these are real characters uh so it's 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 it's, it's what I, I don't know, the information that I can take away, I guess, maybe my, my eyes are limited. I just want to point out to you that uh, you type in 74-year-old lizard, and the only thing pops up is this movie, because lizards don't live that 74 long. is a specific number. I mean, lizards, long-lived lizards. What's the longest living? That live no, to lizard. be 70. Uh, let's check it out. Okay. Uh, Okay, giant tortoise, but see, it has to be a lizard. It cannot be. Yeah, th tortoise. those are uh, amphibians. I mean, um, to we're talking about reptiles. To, to a Tara. Okay, I mean, yeah, I mean, this is a lizard. This could be what he is. They live huh? to be. They wait. What? No, they're. Oh, no! It's saying that it's old, like <laughs> slowest yes. growth rates. They keep Maybe growing until they're about 35. A Tuatora's average lifespan is about 60 years, but they can live up to 100. So he could be a Tuatora. Actually, sure. he looks like he is Probably a Tuatora. Is. Yeah, because I'm going to say, I have lizards, and they live a long time, but not 70 years. Um, uh, one second, we've got an ad break coming. Let me, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to snooze the ad break, because we're, we're taking way too long. Let me, let me check. So, so he could be a real lizard. But yeah, nothing really jumps out at me about this either. It just, it looks like this is going to be... Part of this part of the trailer makes me look at makes it look like it's going to be a lot of Bill Burr and Adam Sandler just kind of hanging out inside of here making jokes, which could be fun. But then the other part of this makes it look like he actually escapes from here. Yeah. But a lot of it is just him in there. So maybe yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Right. It's it's hard to tell whether or not a lot of this is retrospective. I don't know what the dancing clocks are. Maybe it's like you're going to die soon. But uh, yeah. you know, it's just a mortality. <laughs> yeah. Life. That's interesting. Um, let's check out. Well, let's check out what other people have to say about it. Um, here we go. Let's see. Okay, look. Leo looks very hilarious. The animation and voice acting is very good, and I can't wait to see it. I hope Leo. I hope the studio will keep making more family-friendly films. I'm going to tell you something right now. This has got to be a bot because I don't think that this. I don't think that anybody looks at this and goes, "Oh man, this looks absolutely hilarious." I mean, somebody might. I don't yeah, no, know. nobody it's watched a this. Bot, it's a bot that like is responding contextually <laughs> with a certain degree exactly. Of That's what I'm saying. What this movie is selling. Okay, this actually looks amazing and hilarious. I I, I don't know. These have to be bots. On Netflix, my wife <laughs> noticed the other day. Like she goes through, she goes through to um. So Netflix. Most uh, of the accounts on YouTube are not real people. It's like nuts. come on. Yeah, well, I'm just saying. The, okay, the anim. This is the animation we need right now. I hope I'm hopeful about this, guys. An unexpected funny road trip with Leo and his mate. Yeah, I mean that's cool. It's all. It's so awesome to see a Netflix show. What's name is Leo because I am Leo too. Oh, great! Yeah, iguanas are amazing big lizard animals. So I didn't knew they can be pets. What? This has got to be. This has got to. You're not going to find surprising commentary on a trailer that gives limited information for a movie that probably a lot of creative energy probably didn't go into it. Like, I don't know, man. This is going to be really insightful remarks. Yeah. No, but I mean, I thought that people That's would say so whether, they, I mean, something into this all looks like, this does, it looks like it's all bot comments. Um, what is this? This, this looks, dog. yeah, this doesn't look, 
I don't know. Yeah. Anyway, I think it, it could be good. It might not be. I don't know. It might be kind of bland. Might might not be. I don't know. It's, yeah, it doesn't give us a whole lot of information. But I do like Adam Sandler, and I think that he has been making some good stuff. And I do like Bill Burr. So just for those two people working together, I think it's like, oh, it might be worth it just to hear them crack some jokes. So um, go check it out November 21st. But otherwise, we are going to move forward here. Uh, so I snoozed the ad, but I think that I'm going to put us to intermission. We're going to finish up the last. We got one more trailer. So come back after this. Um, put us in intermission and we will see you after these short messages. Don't forget to check me out on Twitch and join the Discord where you can voice chat with me while a live stream and you won't be recorded or anything on YouTube and Twitch. So that's pretty cool. You can also find me on Facebook and Instagram. If you like to read, you can see my after action reports on my blog. And if you are interested, you can get some merch from my spring store. The links for everything are in the description below.